how to turn on end-to-end -end encryption on google messages hi everyone welcome to this tutorial in today's tutorial i'll be showing you how you can turn on end-to-end -end encryption on your google messages application so the first thing to do is to ensure that you have the google messages application installed on your mobile device once you have that ensured the next thing for you to do is to open up the app by clicking on the application okay so once you have the app open, the next thing for you to do is to move to the top right corner of the screen where you would see your profile icon. Alright, once you see it, click on it. And then once you click on it, a box will be displayed showcasing archive, spam and blocked, mark all as read, device pairing, your data in messages. Just click on your data in messages and then you wait for it to load. Alright. Now, once it has loaded, we'll be taken to a page where you'll see discover how messages protect your data, how end to end encryption secures your conversation. Just click on that and then click on how end to end encryption works. This is to guide you and to show you how you can turn on end to end subscription on your Google Messages. So, once you're on this page, the next thing for you to do is to scroll down and then read the instruction. To use end-to-end -end encryption in Google Messages, you and the person or group you message must both use the Google Messages app, have RCS chats turned on, use data or Wi-Fi for rich communication services um, or messages. Okay, so this is the requirement that you have to meet for you to be able to turn on end-to-end -end encryption. Notice that turning on end-to-end -end encryption is not just or for you or it's not just um on your part alone it is both on the person you're sending messages to and on your part to ensure you meet this requirement and once you make this requirements the end-to-end -end encryption will be turned on automatically all right so go ahead and inform that recipient of yours today thanks for watching